This is gonna be us. You know, the ladies. You know, it's now been eight days since Gennady Golovkin annihilated the Mr. Marco Antonio Lobby on two rounds. Yes, and mm. but the Golovkin has now signed to fight Martin Moray in early uh, uh, February over in Europe. And the thing about this is, uh, Moray is a credible opponent. You know, a top ten middleweight uh, who could be a, a linear champion if he didn't have to be on the uh, end of what some feel is a hometown decision as Sergio Martinez last year. But uh, you know, however, it's not the big fight that below that uh, Mr. Golovkin craves. Yes. Uh, you know, the thing about it is, is uh, Miguel Cotto and Sal Alvarez can make them all more funny, um, you know, make more money fighting each other. You know, in an easier fight than Carl Froch and Julio Cesar Jr. are in the same position. You know, the Cotto, Canelo, and Chavez fights are all HBO pay-per-view worthy, and the fighting the Froch in the UK, you know, also brings a big pay-per-view uh, day for Golovkin, you know, with those options unavailable. Should he fight Andre Ward, uh, whose lawyer sent a letter to HBO saying Ward wants to fight Golovkin. You know, if he doesn't, is he ducking? Quack, quack. You know, Ward is a fantastic fighter, you know, as everyone knows. He's an Olympic gold medalist, and he hasn't lost a fight since he was a teenager. And he's being the quality fighters like Golf Roger with ease. You know, he's the WBA ring super middleweight uh, title holder and is a top three pound for pound fighter. And he says he wants to fight Golovkin, who wants a big fight. So what's the problem? Calabrias will have more details later. Wink, wink.